Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erin and today we're going to be vacuuming the main floor of my house. It's also going to be a video where you get to know me a little bit better and hopefully I get to know you a little bit better. So I hope you enjoy. The night before, I cleaned up all of those toys and all the Play-Doh and all the Kinect sand. My kids have been really into playing with that lately, which I encourage, but it took a little bit of prep work before I could start vacuuming. I usually start in the front of my house. So this is the path I like to take. So the order you're watching this video is the way I actually clean or vacuum my floors. For whatever reasons, I feel the house is most clean when the floors are vacuumed and washed. I don't know what it is about that to me. I guess maybe walking around barefoot and not feeling any crumbs or sticky stuff on the floor just makes me feel like the house is completely clean, which I really, really love. I wanted to share a little bit about myself so you can get to know me a little bit better and then I can get to know you guys a little bit better. So we moved from New York in 2020 to a very small town in New England. It is very rural. It is very small town. Um, and I was very nervous about living here. I was used to living in the suburbs outside of New York and being able to walk to the store and being able to see my neighbors and my family, walk into parks, there's no walking here. You have to literally drive 20 minutes out to get to a store. And my husband finds it funny because he did not think I was gonna be so comfortable so fast. He really thought it was gonna take me about, I don't know, three or four months to be comfortable here, when in reality, it only took me about two days. I was scared. But it's so peaceful here and we're really happy. So I'm really loving it up here.
am really convinced that my house is the crumb capital of the world. We have so many crumbs here. I, I think it's just we have some magnetic pull. This is dried up Play-Doh that I really thought I got from last night. I did not. Nope. Found it. Had to awkwardly move this ottoman out of my way and then get back to vacuuming. There was once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait Our first time, our first day You're so fine, I'm so late You sip wine, I drink straight Don't waste time, to my place I feel my heart erase So catch me if I fall comments below if you are a reader. I am a huge reader. I love to read. If I could spend all of my free time reading, I would. Any book recommendations, put them in the comments, please, because I am always looking for a new book. I'm always looking for a new series. I am always looking for new reads. The last series that I was completely obsessed with, like everyone else, is the Court of Thorns and Roses series. I told all of my friends, all of my family, I begged them actually to please read these books and we all became obsessed. There is a TV show in the works. I am hoping they get the casting down perfectly because if they don't, I know we're all gonna be really upset. If you haven't read them, I recommend them and if you have, Please let me know how you feel in the comments because, you know, I love to talk about them. don't have a lot of free time on my hands, so I don't watch a lot of TV. My husband and I have been told by a number of people that we should start Yellowstone. So if you've watched Yellowstone, let me know what you think. Uh, I'm definitely interested in it. It looks pretty good. And from what people have explained to me, you get hooked fast. So we're intrigued for sure. I admittedly love reality TV. I know it's the worst stuff and not the best to watch, but I really find it to be my guilty pleasure. So if I can have a little bit of alone TV time, it's usually me watching a lot of reality TV shows. did not vacuum my bedroom because my sweet dog Reno was resting in there and I didn't want the vacuum to disturb him. But I will be filming another video where I will be cleaning my bedroom and my bathroom. So stay tuned for that. But that looks like it's it for today's video, guys. Thanks so much for hanging out and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.